Sunday, the 9th of October. One more day and I've been vlogging on and off for a year on YouTube. So that's really great. It's been four weeks. Um, yeah, uh, store update is it's pretty much the same as it was four weeks ago. I've been selling stuff, but I <laughs> I haven't parted out anything. The video tiles are still in the cups. Um, yeah, uh, I've been distracted with looking for another hobby as this is more and more getting out of hand and I want something to stimulate the mind sometimes as this can get really repetitive. Um, yeah, that's also why I stopped the vlogs for a while, as you know, I just couldn't <laughs> uh, repeat myself over and over again. So for now, I'm thinking about other ways to create content so you guys can keep up to date with the stores. But it's yeah a bit different for me, so you don't get in the same cycle every week. Um, I've been distracted with model trains, so won't be covering any of them on this channel, but yeah, then you know which or what is distracting me. Um, the research has given me a lot of joy just to do something else than parting out and order picking, as with new parts, that's just the cycle of the saw. Um, yeah, not really much has changed, as I mentioned. Uh, there will be coming in the last batch of the uh, seller plethora of bricks, and then we are done with the deal we've made. And after that part out, I'm going to source my own Lego again. And in the meantime, if you guys have any suggestions on how to create some other content, but still get updates, you know, uh, which isn't repetitive for me, please do let me know. I'm still thinking about it myself, but if you have any good suggestions, leave them down in the comments. For now, we've gotten four orders to pull. Um, let me see. So yeah, still using Brikker, really happy with it. I gotta create some videos about it. I still gotta do that. I know, so I'm going to find time in the coming few days or weeks to create the first episode about the software I'm using. For now, I'm going to pay, pull four orders and yeah, won't be doing much else as I'm going to wait till the new Lego arrives and yeah, that's it. On to picking orders. All the orders are picked. I uh, usually, before I ship them, dry fit them on top of the envelope as of late. So I know which shipping method to choose without putting all in the envelope and getting it out to put on the label. Um, yeah, all the orders, some bigger ones, some smaller ones. And um, one order still needs to be paid, so that probably will happen in the next few days, I guess. We'll see. Uh, yeah, going to pack the orders now, get them ready for shipping and enjoy the Sunday evening. And going to wait till the new batch of Lego comes in, a bit parting out and stuff. Um, yeah, still got to do these, these, these sets, but mm, those will come in good time. <laughs> Tuesday, the 11th of October, and we've gotten in the last batch of the other store, a plethora of bricks. Um, he added some goodies. Last time it looked like I was missing a load of these bricks, so he added them, which is really cool. Um, also, I was complaining a bit about Duplo and being a flat rate killer, so he kindly <laughs> gave me more Duplo to complain about. <laughs> um, and there were some video tiles in here. Ah, 
uh, which he hadn't sorted yet and as I still have a load of them to go um, he said enjoy so yeah really great other than that there are a multitude of sets in here all smaller quantities so it should be a bit easier for part outs um, probably will start on a part out of a set tomorrow and I might do the Duplo tonight. I'll probably chuck it in these bins. I'm not really sure if I got any space. Uh, one of them. So yeah, I uh, gotta see where I put them. I'm probably not going to sort them that much as it's big pieces and easy recognizable when picking it. So yeah. Um, Time to get a move on again. Duplo is all put away. Oops. In the drawers. Maybe a bit too much in one. But it works. Two of the small ones and one of the bigger ones is filled up. Um, yeah. The other stuff will be for tomorrow. And we'll see how the Duplo goes. Um, and tomorrow will be some part outs on the schedule. It's Wednesday, the 12th of October. And for today there will be a part out on the schedule. At least the Harry Potter set 76399. Uh, as that's the one on top. So we'll start with this. A bit later today um, yeah <clears throat> I just realized I've been a year on YouTube and it all started with this video which is kind of giving me the chills welcome to my store and sort of break I just started this store um, I will be Vlogging my experience on how it is to start a new store, start small, grow bigger, show you. Yeah, most of you know it. Um, if I watch that video back and look at where we started, uh, me as a vlogger in English, of course, and the size of the store, it's gotten quite out of hand. Um, yeah, it's really cool. We've already <coughs> passed uh, 600 subscribers, which is amazing. And in this year, you watched the videos for almost 4,000 hours. And yeah, if I want to get paid by YouTube, I still got halfway to go, but that's okay. I don't see YouTube as a <coughs> source of income in the future. It's only yeah a bit of marketing for the store. But yeah, what a year it's been. Had some up and downs with YouTube. Just uh, last month, I didn't feel like vlogging. Trying to pick it up again. Um, so yeah, thank you all for watching, subscribing and following along with the story. Okay, had a slight change of plans today. As it's the one year anniversary of me being on YouTube, I created a small uh, recap video with some of the highlights. Didn't capture them all as I didn't want it to be a long video, but pretty happy with how it turned out. Uh, for now, <clears throat> It took me quite some time, so no part outs. Did got two orders, one for the baby and the bigger one going off to the United States. So yeah, as always, thank you. It's amazing. These parts came from a pick a brick cup. So nice to see them move all at once. About 250, I believe. So yeah, turned out to be a good investment, the cup. So yeah, going to pack them and then release the year of unsorted brick video.
It's Thursday, the 13th of October, and it's finally time for some part outs again. Going to start on the big box. First one up is the Harry Potter set 67399, this time for real. <laughs> As yesterday, I didn't get around to it. Five bags and some sticker sheets. Harry Potter sticker sheets tend to do well for me. The last ones I had in the store were gone before I knew it. So yeah, I think some of the parts will move quite fast and it's always good to add some new inventory and get back towards the 100k items. Parts are all put away. Only got to finish the minifigures. And then we've got to pull some orders as they keep coming in tonight. So yeah, um, it's just one minifigure and a lot of parts as these minifigures are interchangeable, customizable. So it will be nice to add some parts for, for uh, Harry Potter. Saturday, the 15th of October. Um, had a party yesterday and it got in quite late in the night, so I will only be pulling orders today. We've gotten three, two so far have been pulled, some window pieces and a brick head set with some minifig pieces. Um, yeah, for the rest of the day, uh, I won't be doing anything in the store, so it will be a shorter vlog this week, but yeah. Um, those weeks happen, life takes over, and Lego needs to wait a bit. Um, yeah, tomorrow I'll be doing some more part outs, of course, but for now, um, thank you all for watching. Have a nice week, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye bye.